Hey guys, it's Sasha. I was coming to make a video to let you guys know about day three of my juicing. Of course, today is day four, but I have some stuff to tell y'all about that. So, um, the first thing is what I want to talk about the way... Why are you staring at me like that? I want to talk about the way that I'm feeling. <laughs> um, I feel really good. Like I feel energized and I feel like more focused. And that was the main reason why I wanted to do it. Um, and... I don't know, I kind of want to continue to do it, even though I kind of ate early, early this morning, late last night. Um, but I want to continue to juice, and I think I want to, like, do, like, a like a salad or, like, something small throughout the day that's not, like, too horrible. But anyway, um, let me go through the same list that I went through through the other videos, just to kind of keep things in order and on track. So the first thing I want to talk about is hunger. Um, I think the third day of any type of cleansing that I've ever done is always, like, the worst day. Um, it's like the pass or fail day. So, um, it was really tough. I was very hungry, but I also did a lot of physical activity and I didn't have as much juice as I should have to match the activity that I did. So, um, that's one reason why I was more hungry. Stop being distracting me. That's why I was more hungry. Um, the next thing that I want to say with that, well, to add on to that, is I think that if I would have had more juice, I would have been able to fight my cravings or urges a little bit better. Um, the next thing that I want to talk about is urination and my stomach and how my stomach felt. Um, I did. It was. I didn't like OD when I went to the bathroom, but it was um, still like a very faint yellow. It was barely, barely any yellow in it. Um, and of course, depending on the the color, the more clear it is, the more hydrated your body is. Mm-hmm. And um, as far as my stomach, it, it feels pretty fine. It didn't feel like uneasy or unsettled or anything like that. Um, I think it really helped when I did the apple cider vinegar shots. Now, whenever I do those, they make my stomach feel really hot. And I, I honestly do feel like I'm taking an actual shot of like some gin or something like burns your throat. But the last couple of days since I've been doing it, it's not as bad. Um, it feels weird again initially, but after like a couple of minutes, you're fine. Um, I've been following it with the detox tea. Um, I didn't drink a lot of it yesterday, but um, I like that um, that I talked about in the last video. I think that helps. Um, the next thing is uh, fruits and vegetables. Yesterday, I'm not even going to front. I did more fruits than veggies. Um, yeah. <laughs> I did all my pineapples. I did like four apples. Um, I think I had maybe an orange in there for some reason. I don't even know where that orange came from. I hope it was ours. And then um, <laughs> I should have done a little bit more at night, but I didn't. As far as my sleep, I still went to bed like extra late for no damn reason. But um, all together, I think it was like seven and a half hours. Um, and it was good. As far as my dreams... And when I've done a juice feast or a water fast before, I've had, like, really vivid dreams that are, like, just amazing. But I really didn't have a lot of dreams. Um, as far as any detoxing, I don't I don't really feel like I had any crazy symptoms. I was really moody yesterday. Um, everything my boo said kind of, like, was annoying. That and then, like, I annoyed it. myself. This is a normal... I'm not... I'm not irritable. But, um... <laughs> so, I was a little irritable, but, um... Overall, I, like, I felt good, and then we went mountain biking. That's the activity that I wanted to add because I was going to the gym the other day. So my activity yesterday was mountain biking, which is pretty tough. Um, we normally can do several miles, but we did, well, my tracker said 6.4 miles um, mountain biking. And that's like, you know, uh, I don't know, like, is it terrain? I don't know. I don't know. It was like out in the, like the woods, the jungle or whatever, the forest. So um, it was really good. Um, it was a lot of climbing and a lot of leg work. I felt like I was going to pass out. Um, but it was really fun. It was invigorating because we hadn't done it in a while. So I was really excited to do that together. And um, what else? Oh, yeah, my weight. I started off at 197. I weighed myself just now. I'm 188, which is kind of cool, I guess. Um, as far as how I feel, I don't feel any lighter, I guess I would say. I still felt the same when I was doing yoga. I did feel more flexible, just with just flexing. Um, I kind of feel like I could run more and, and do a little bit more in that aspect as far as energy. Um, this is a shot of everything. As far as my measurements, I think my waist went down an inch. 
Because he measured me last night. Really? <laughs> it did too, because I was at 29. And it's like, what'd you get, 28? Oh, yeah, it went down that quick. Yeah, it did go down that quick. And then, um... Stop, please, turn me the video. And then my, but my hips are still the same. They're still a 45. And again, it's only been three days, so it's not like crazy. Um, but yeah, that's it. So a total of nine pounds, which is cool. Um, today I wanted to show you guys what I'm about to juice, just to give you an idea of what I do. Um, so hopefully you can see it. My apples just fell. But it's cucumbers, kale, strawberries. I have a whole lemon. I told y'all I was gonna juice a whole lemon. Um, <clears throat> and that's it, really. So I'm about to juice that. And last night I got really hungry, which was this morning. So I finished the the three days, but I was really hungry. There was like there was like a what was it? What kind of soup is it? Vegetable soup. Vegetable soup. <laughs> and like once I like I ate it, like I felt like. My stomach was like irritated, I guess, a little bit. And it was it was more watery or whatever. So I kind of munched on that. And then I actually drank another juice. And then I went to sleep. And that was like four this morning, three something this morning. So, yeah, my sleep has been kind of crazy. It's been wacky. But, yeah, so that's what I, I did. As far as what I'm going to continue to do, I think I'm going to continue to juice like I feel really good I want to try to juice and I at least juice until all my fruits and veggies are gone out of the fridge and I literally have a lot left so um I won't only do the juice probably if we get to go to Cheesecake Factory today um I want to I want the salad I want an Olive Garden salad for some reason but I guess I can make it on my own um but that's what I've been craving uh but I'm glad that I've been craving a salad and not like fried chicken Oh, and the other day, he went to Popeye's, and it was, like, the hardest thing on the planet because I really wanted the catfish, the fried catfish, and it was really hard. But that is my challenges. That's everything that I did. I just want to keep you guys posted on what went on. So, in total, um, the last two days, I did the apple cider vinegar shots in the morning. I did the detox tea for the liver and kidneys. Um, I did the smooth move at night to make sure that I had a movement. Day two, I didn't have a movement. Day three, I did. Day one, I did as well. Um, what else? I lost um, nine pounds. So I'm 188 now. I'm five, six and a half. And my waist went down an inch. Everything else stayed the same. <laughs> um, so that's kind of cool. Everybody wants their waist to go down. What else? I think that's pretty much it. I'll probably come back to give you guys a heads up on my workout and what I'm doing within the next couple of days but I hope everybody has a good day thanks for watching my videos and that's it